uh, we shall continue to the number of palings. The palings, they are those uh, horizontal frames that the roof covering will lie on. They are distributed along the width. Actually, they are distributed along the rafters because they 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 support the roof covering. So, uh, what is the length of the rafter? 35, 85 millimeters. So, how many palings will we have if the spacing of the palings is one meter? It's 35, 85 divided by one meter plus one. So, it shall be 35, 85 divided by one meter plus one, 4.585, say five meters. So, the number of palings will be equal to two sides of the roofs. So, it's two times five number of palings in each side. Then, the length of the paling is 20 meters. Why 20 meters? It's because we take the total length of the house, which is uh, 19,000 plus 200 of the walls on both sides plus 300 of the eaves on both sides it gets to 20 meters we go to scarf joints on palings so uh the total length of the palings is 20 meters if it's 20 meters and uh we have the timber making the palings is six meters so we shall take 20,000 divided by 6 meters. 20,000 divided by 6 meters. Then we plus 1. So 20,000 divided by 6 meters. We cancel out. It's 20 divided by 6. Which is 3.3. 3. So we say 4. So the number of scuffed joints on the palings we always subtract if it's 3.3 .3, we subtract one to get the number of joints so it is 2.3 that is two joints so we have how many palings we have five each side five on each side how many sides two the number of joints on each paling two so the total number of joints shall be two times five times two joints we go to ridge board. The ridge board we calculated and found that it shall be 13.40 meters. So it's 13.40 meters, uh, 175 by 25 millimeters ridge board. How many joints on the ridge board? 13.40 divided by 36 meters minus 1. We get one scarf joint on the ridge board.